Shalom and welcome to the Code Searcher. Folks, you may remember um, December of 2017, there was 250 rabbis in Jerusalem that declared Donald Trump to be the Cyrus of the end times. But if you recall, um, it was this channel. Myself and Chris um, discovered in the codes some really disturbing anomalies concerning Donald Trump or uh, Hillary Clinton. If you recall, and it's only got 13,000 views, but uh, November 5th, 2016, and before, we were revealing this before, I was on a talk radio, a Hagman show, and revealed that the codes were indicating that Donald Trump would win the presidency. Um, but also that Hillary would steal. It, it just, uh, at the time, I could not quantify what that meant. Um, the, my point is, uh, it was established well after we told you guys on this channel by all of Judaism, the very same thing that I was telling you. What do you mean by that? Let me Let me explain. Please, hang on. If you go to Isaiah 45, you'll find a very interesting uh, chapter in Isaiah about a Mashiach, which is an anointed one, called Cyrus. In Hebrew, his name is Koresh, but uh, for the sake of you who are King James only, his name is Cyrus. Um, so let me read to you what it says here. And thus saith Yehua to his anointed, to his Mashiach, Cyrus, whose right hand I have Hold him to subdue the nations before him, and I will loose the loins of kings to open before him the two lead, uh, leaved gates, and the gates shall not be shut. And I will go before thee and make the crooked places straight, and I will break the pieces of gates of brass and cut asunder the, bra the, bar the bars of iron. And I will give thee treasures of darkness and hidden riches of secret places that thou may knowest that I, Yahuwah, which call thee by name, am the Elohim of Israel. For Jacob my servant's sake, and Israel mine elect, have I called thee by thy name, and I have surnamed thee, though thou hast not known me. Uh, this is really fascinating, folks, because this wasn't a particular righteous man. Uh, he was actually a wicked man, but uh, the Father chose him as the vessel for his purposes. And I submit to you, the last vessel we had, uh, a.k.a. Barack Obama, was not a suitable vessel for light. Donald Trump is. We were very accurate in what we discovered about this president, folks. And I have to show you something very disturbing um, that I'm, I'm very difficult for me to present this to you. So bear with me in, uh, in this. Uh, there are those watching this um, that could probably do something about what I'm going to show you. I don't know why I'm supposed to reveal this to you, I'm just being obedient. Um, our Father's will will be done. And in everything there is purpose. Um, so I am not prophesying something is going to happen to our president. But folks, I am certain with a high probability that our president is in, is in danger from his own people. Um, so let me just show you what I'm talking about. This is the table. Um, this is the one that pretty much let us know that he was going to win the presidency. And I can tell you that this very one has been all around uh, the rabbis and those in, in Judaism in, in Israel about this president. It is a collaboration. What do you mean by the code searcher? Well, one of the most amazing anomalies in this, I didn't find. 
Eliyahu Rips found, but I found the initial table. I, I can prove uh, that I was on a talk radio show talking about this very table. Um, and so it's been this long, uh, which has been a couple of years by now. Um, and this is staggering information. Staggering. I'm a little bit nervous um, because uh, I have family and this is the kind of things that can get you disappeared. Um, so with that being said, if you would help me, those that know what I'm talking about when I'm, when I'm doing these codes, I'm not talking about the passerby that sees these things and just mocks. I take it very seriously because this is... I, this is something divine that who has given us to reconcile his word, but also to receive warning. That is another purpose for these codes. Um, the future is contained. I'm not going to beat around the bush or lie to you about it. It is there. Past, present, and future all contained there. Now, this is Donald Trump. That's the access term. This, this same one, again, same one I talked about on the Hackman Show and everywhere else. Um, it's the same one that Rips has worked on. This is the anomaly in yellow that he found, which is, of course, the name of the murderer or the name of the killer. Um, it's kind of, you know, like the Twin Towers. Uh, but then the clustering that uh, is contained here and then all the detail. I want to show you something. Look at the difference between a lot of the Gentiles and Donald Trump's table. Did you notice the difference? In this one, I have a, uh, a lot of chapters and verses that are highlighted, which uh, in a code uh, in a code aspect, this is compounding information that adds another element um, to what we're seeing. This table didn't need it because of the the intricacies of what happened in the ELS form. It does contain names, proper names. And this is what makes me nervous because if anything happens to this president, folks, and I think there's a high probability it will, and I think the reason it will happen uh, is, I don't want to get into that. We'll do that another time. But there is a purpose in it. It's got something to do with Israel um, and a host of other things. Um, there's some very evil people at play here, and they are here in this table, uh, as you as you'll see. Um, where do you start? So, Ayom, Ayom crosses over, which is a threat. There is absolutely a threat from within, as you can see in the blue there, from within. Um, so again, we got Donald Trump. We've got appointed, and then uh, in the white we have Nasi. That was, you know, basically what I'd revealed on um, the Hagman show, and this is why I, I felt that it was a high probability he would be elected as president. Then again, we couldn't understand what it meant that Hillary would steal. But um, what I didn't reveal to you, what is the four letters right next to that, which is um, essentially it's a sentence when you put it all together. And we can go over to the Google Translator so you don't know him. You know, some may think I'm pulling your leg. How do we know what he's telling the truth? All right. Um, so we've got Nasi, which is uh, president. And then four more letters. I want you to see the letters. It's Yod, Chet, Tet, Olive. Yod, Chet, Tet, Olive. The president will sin. Right there in the plain text, uh, the president will sin. And uh, the connection that's going on here, as you can see, it, it's it's running right there. Um, but we've got, uh, how did that get undone? That's supposed to be done too, because we have a, a, a vertical extension on the end of this, which is minyan. Uh, in Hebrew, minyan is basically um, a group of ten. Could be ten men. It's usually ten men. Um, 
but, but I suppose it could be a mixture of, of people. Anyway, uh, so we've got a minyan, right? Right there. That is appointed. That's Moed. And then we have 666. Six, six. Now that second Vav uh, is the Vav in the word Annie's murder. Right? <laughs> that crosses over the yellow anomaly, which is the name of the assassin. Okay? Uh, in the blue and the green are proper... Uh, I mean, excuse me... Um, yeah, the proper names. They're they're basically names that I notice in the, in a lateral in a vertical sense. Um, and anytime you see something like that, it is absolutely significant. Um, so anyway, uh, here here's something that that I notice. For instance, uh, the the three vavs. It is it, at a particular uh, skip on that. We have three vavs here as well. The same skip, right? So. Um, it happens to be a clustering with a proper name there. And uh, I just happen to know a name of this, you know, a person I knew long ago with the same name. And that's, that's probably why I noticed that name is Romech, right? But on top of that is an extension, which is um, he is Romech. Then there's um, he's the shooter. <laughs> And that hay there is a mountain of mourning. Uh, and undoubtedly, if, if this happens, um, it, there would be a great darkness over this country, folks. So people will mourn. And, and, I mean, quite possibly be um, very similar to JFK. And uh, I have my reasons for that. You know, the, the different uh, folks, I'm very nervous talking about this table because I know the significance and the ramifications and the repercussions of revealing something like this but I, I think you was going to do something I don't know what that is I just know I'm supposed to to show you this um, I was in the Marines and uh, one of the missions of the Corps is to protect the president. Um, I was very outspoken. The last president we had, those of you who watch this channel know that I didn't particularly like that president. This one, <clears throat> I kind of like him, folks. I'm not going uh, to lie to you. I think he's a good guy. I, I think, you know, it, it, he's, he's beat around the bush about repenting. Um, but you know, what does that mean? I think he's a good person overall, and I, I, I don't want to see anything happen to him. But I think something will. And that, that really scares me. Because the only other time I've seen something like this is with the Yixok Rabin table. And it happened one year later. Now, the time frame on this, folks, the parallels I see with JFK are striking, okay? So, um, it's well into his first, his first, his first term. And uh, if you want to know more, you just go back and look at the JFK uh, administration and when he was cut down. Uh, if, if, you, if I was to put a month on it, I would say May is a good month to put on there. Maybe I'm giving too much details, but um, there's a lot here, guys. It, it reveals a lot. If something happens, guaranteed, every player is here, okay? I showed you that in the JFK table, so just remember that. The deep state, look at this, the deep state. Again, crossing over the yellow anomaly, right? Look at this same word up here with three deaths. Three deaths, and hidden. Um, it's, it would absolutely be an oat, which is sign. Okay, keep that in mind. Um, Donald, uh, you can see in the white, Donald, his first name crosses over. Um, we've got judgment and three vobs. Three vobs is 666 and uh, secret right there. 
And then we have the year he was elected, right? In the plain text, Hetav Shin An Vav, which is 2016. And then look at this, Mashiach. Who's called a Mashiach? Cyrus. As you can see, Cyrus, it is a vertical anomaly in close proximity to his name. And look at this, Moed. Uh, the same word appointed as, as right here. Cyrus. Mashiach. And then also the Mashiach, and that is war that's balanced on there. There's no secret that his uh, rhetoric has been uh, quite you know, stern with North Korea and uh, other countries. And, and I don't mind that, but what I see in the codes it indicates, folks, that World War III is very close. Um, it concerns me. I have a family, and uh, I want you to keep me in my family in prayer. Um, we're we're in, in in serious times, folks. I cannot stress that enough. There are those of you who are who are stuck in erroneous doctrines, and uh, I, I've done what I can to show you that. And um, I've been, I've, there's been stones thrown at me, you know, uh, accusations that uh, I walked away from the faith and I've, I've been Judaized, yada, 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 all this trash. And I'll let it roll off my back. But it does get to me sometimes. Uh, you, you know, you just can't, you just can't help to feel a sense of loss for those that just walked away from you and uh, never talked to you again. It's kind of interesting to see your Facebook numbers go down and wonder, who was that that unfriended me? What was it I said? I've always tried to give you truth. No matter how hard. This worries me. Folks, it is no question if something happens to our president, um, the end is, is very close. There are those in the deep state who don't want the, the swamp drained. They're quite happy with the stench and they don't want it, they don't want it drained. Okay, so um, please help me get this out. If you can, tweet it to the president. Tweet it to him. Tweet it to those around him um, so that they know that this does exist. The prophecies that parallel him and his role with Israel. That is what it's all about, folks. He needed a vessel. He needed a vessel. And Donald Trump is that man, guys. He needs our prayers. But Yahuwah's will be done. Right? That's that's what we all want. Prophecy is going to be fulfilled, guys. He will come. And he will gather us. But there are things that are going to happen first, okay? You're going to witness. Folks, if you haven't before, please support the channel. Please subscribe, like, and share the video. And if you could, support us with a donation. We could really use it. Yeshua bless you and keep you. Shalom.